contest. All points of the compass lead to the sea. Yes, this is Brighton, new and sophisticated, old and sedate. Now we all know that story, one we like so much, of a man that you cannot kill. Well, his gun is his word, and he goes with the birds, and his name is Wild Bill. He has the measure of the beast, that thing from way out east, where the maidens fall like firecracker trees. But the West is the best in life, and not dead. Chickens all come home All the women at the ivy And the old folks going politely They make young wild bill feel so alone So now he's arriving in the desert Beasting on his ear Thunder rolling heavy on his tree Fear is the spring of sex and war and everything And the bees and billies riding for the grave to PCP. It's PCP 709 and that is my latest favourite band that I've found. Uh, they are called Opus Kick, or sorry, Kink rather. Uh, they are from Brighton and that was the track called Wild Bill which is uh, a double A side of their latest single which is rather marvellous. Went to a festival, a little festival uh, on Saturday. Uh, it was Saturday and Sunday but I only went to the Saturday. Um, primarily to see a band I'm going to play a bit more of later called English Teacher who have been playing before um and uh, hoping to see some good new bands and that was one of them uh, six piece band absolutely full full on uh, great fun and definitely worth checking out if you live in the brighton area or or perhaps in the london area i don't know i'm not quite sure but definitely worth checking them out Right, I should be playing some more tracks from that uh, particular festival later, but now I'm going to go back to playing something from my, uh, my, one of my all time favourite bands, really, Louis Ling and the Bombs. Uh, I played you a track called No Joke last week. Uh, there are some remixes available. This one is rather well, excellent. It's the American Pop Remix by Patron. Check it out. Shaking while I walk.
tell you. So two more tracks there for you, the first of which was um, by Lewis Ling and the Bombs. That was the remix version, the American pop remix version, with lots of sort of, uh, um, what do you call them, um, xylophones, stuff like that, which I absolutely adore, uh, of their track No Joke, which I played the original for, version of for you last week, which I hope you rather enjoyed. And then after that, we heard something from Shika Shika Records. Uh, it was it was by Han Hajna. H-A-J-N-A, Hajna, uh, featuring Faisal Nakur, and the track was called Caravan, which I thought was rather excellent. Now, I mentioned um, going to this festival. It was called the, um, uh, what was it? Uh, what was it called? Oh, I can't remember the name of it now. Uh, da, 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 da. Was it Find Joy? I think it was Find Joy. The Find Joy Festival from um, Joy 
uh, concerts which are based in Brighton and we put it on various things in various different places uh, it was very good indeed and I particularly wanted to see this band from Leeds uh, this is English Teacher I have played them before when they were uh, supposed to be playing at the, the Great Escape and they played a, a set um, in isolation and uh, sent the video down to the Great Escape website this is good English Teacher and it's a track called R&B no, no, wait for it, wait for it to remember a name to forget.
Right, two more tracks there for you. First of which was R&B. Uh, we are playing R&B? Oh, we aren't playing R&B. We're not playing R&B, are we? English teacher, definitely worth checking them out from Leeds. Um, and then after that, I ha- we had a track from Lost Frog Records, which is always a bit amazingly madness. And I loved it. It was uh, Vix NV. Uh, V-I-X-E-N-V-Y. Vix NV. And a track called Ni- Nishiyo. Uh, I presume it's all the Japanese because most of this stuff here is either Japanese um, produced or Japanese derived, but uh, but very good it was. Right, I met uh, a few people when I was at my uh, festival on Saturday. I uh, had a nice chat with a couple of people. Um, one of which was a couple called Ian and Helen, and they were telling me about a, uh, an artist that they really thought I should get into, a guy by the name of Bob Villain. Uh, that's V-Y-L-A-N, so it's like Bob Dylan, but place the B with a V, um, and I had a listen, and this is awesome, this is full on, this is full on swearing, um, it's full on loud, it has got a sentiment that is, you either love or you hate, I love it, I think it's absolutely fantastic, it's a really important message this, I think, so uh, let's get to it, this is We Live Here by Bob Villain. <laughs> before you come here, lovely.
the two tracks. The first was the very loud, very uh, shouty, very, very interesting Bob Villain. Uh, if you check out the video of that particular track, which is called We Leave Here, uh, you'll find he's, uh, he's a mixed race uh, Rasta man. Uh, and he was wearing a crass T-shirt when he was singing that particular song, which kind of fits, which kind of fits. So, yeah, uh, very much of, of an anthem about uh, about being black in the UK. And, um, and not that I know anything about being black in the UK, but I do support the message he's putting forward. And after that, we heard Zeke Zeke, uh, which is X-I-Q-U-E, uh, dash X-I-Q-U-E, uh, on Tropical Twister Records, and the track was called De Repente which was rather good. Moving on, moving on. Something new came to us from Culture Dub Records. Uh, our old friend Habu Dubs, who features quite a lot on the Dub, dub Zone, not, not, not the Drub Zone, the Dub Zone. Uh, and this is a track called Lemon Nectar. <laughs> Thank you. 
everything under the sun, including the palm trees. Right, that was by uh, Iliak, Iliak, uh, I-L-I-A-Q-U-E, Iliak, uh, a track called Un Monde de Messange, uh, available from Bandcamp. And then before that, we heard Haribu Dubs and his track Lemon Nectar, which came out on Culture Dubs. Now, not only did I see uh, Opus Kink and I saw uh, English Teacher, I saw a couple of other bands. I'm going to play one next week, but another one I quite enjoyed. Um, they are from Galway, I believe, in Ireland. Uh, this is New Dad. They were supposed to play The Great Escape as well. And this track is called Blue.
I'm telling you. This could turn Ari Krishna into a bad boy. Um, Shoegaze from New Dead uh, a track called Blue uh, picked that up at Bandcamp definitely worth checking them out if you can get a chance to see them I hope some of these bands will be back for The Great Escape 
um, or possibly other places uh, soon to see them again because I thought they were rather excellent. Uh, and then after that we heard uh, the Pantera Jungle remix uh, by Root Zombie of a track originally by Funny and Fleury uh, from his 10 Years in Dub uh, remix album which came out on Marie Bass of course uh, which is always rather excellent. Let's have a bit of uh, drum and bass. Right, let's have something completely different. Uh, this is Adrienne Prikop featuring Vasile Rus and the track is called Doina Aradina.
Right, that was a, a track called uh, Doina Aradiana, not Ar- Aradina, as I said earlier, uh, on a label called Luna the Cat, which I think I played some stuff from before, before, but I'm not quite sure. Uh, that particular track was by Adrian Prikop, or Adrian Prikop, uh, featuring Vasily Rus, and uh, that was rather, rather marvellous. Right, I'm going to leave you with one last track. I hope you have enjoyed what you listened to so far. I will be back in a week or two or three or whatever uh, with some more great music. I am going to another gig uh, this weekend. I'm going to see Leg Puppy, and I will have some Leg Puppy um, for you to listen to next week. Their album's out, uh, and it's rather good, so check it out. This is uh, another track from a mashup, really, um, a reggae mashup by the excellent Black Market, um, or Black Market Dub, and he has got his own website on Bandcamp, called blackmarketdub.bandcamp.com, of course. This track features Wise Owl on Dub Robot, and it's a, it's a track you might recognise. I won't say any more than that, I'm sure you'll recognise it, but I think it's a rather good reggae version. I'm sure it hasn't been done before. Right, enjoy. I'll see you soon, folks.
BBC podcast. The chances are you'll actually like it. Come on.